Hello, and welcome to Fortune Forecast Channel for your daily tarot reading and more, where I use the wisdom of tarot to give you a general insight for the day. What I do is not magic. It's natural to all of us. We engage life through our senses. We see images and numbers, and we process that information to choose what we will do next. I invite you to give yourself a few minutes of entertainment as I tap into the collective consciousness and interpret today's message. Thank you again for being with me and feel free to leave your comments, share, and subscribe to my channel. Okay, let's get started. Okay, today is Tuesday, a fresh new month, Tuesday, February 1, 2022. A new start, a new month, a new mindset. Okay, so let's get started. What is our first area to look into? Our first area is money. And let's see what, what that holds for us today. Money, 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 money. Okay, so it feels good when we don't have any worries. So today's one of those days. If you are investing, this is a take and grab what you can opportunity type of day. But it also, there is enough to be, be uh, setting yourself up for more opportunities um, in the sense of our everyday experience. When we come in with that level of gratitude, the attitude of gratitude, the mindset of gratitude, we feel so comfortable in our place. We feel so at ease. And this is that, that place. We just have to make sure that um, we're mindful also, um, you know, of, of our, our place in the world. You know, if we've got enough to give, well, we find ways that we can add value to other people's lives because we have so much of it. When this card shows up, it's, it's just really one of those cards that it's wonderful this way where, um, you know, you see this person sitting there just like comfortable and just sitting in and, and surrounded by all this wealth and this abundance of cups, more than you can drink, don't you think? So when this particular card, which is the nine of cups shows up, when it's upside down. It's not really a negative, only for us to, to be mindful of, you know, not overindulging, not overindulging in things, because sometimes that could um, tip things over and not in a very good way. So you want to make sure that you're not apathetic to other people's needs, just because you have everything, you know, and you don't want to come across. I mean, if, if that's, I mean, if you want to, I, I guess you can, but it, for the most part, to follow that path of enlightenment, that path of growing and expanding, and to to be that beautiful light that you are, um, to definitely uh, find that balance. And, and when it comes to money, there will be no problems about that today. There's not going to be any, as long as we have that attitude of gratitude. Let's remember that the attitude of gratitude. Okay, the next one coming up, the next one that we have for today, for today, is let's look at the area of relationship, the area of relationship.
Okay. Wow, this is a very nice card. Um, open communication, it's one of those things. Uh, most important, there's going to be love is in the air. So there's uh, definitely opportunity for budding relationships as being expressed here. And this is great beginning, a great, um, you know, uh, what can I say, energy for this. And, you know, takes taking that leap of faith and moving forward with that. And as far as that relationship, whether, whether it could be a partnership or that new relationship, or this could mean so many things you know for some of you uh, could be fertility or birth uh, a lot of good things that come with this beautiful card and and in, even in that that context of spirituality and getting these divine messages and that relationship that deeper relationship with the divine and the creator and uh, so this is a beautiful card and a beautiful message for for all of us as it's coming through and, and just being sensitive and opening up to what comes your way today. So definitely good stuff on the home front, good stuff in the heart front in general, beautiful in all your relationships, keeping, keeping that communication going, keeping that compassion going and nurturing your relationships. Okay, next one up is going to be, what's it going to be? Okay, it's going to be health, health. Okay, what do we have here? health. Okay. So we have a knight of wands here. And some of you are getting back on track with your health and taking it very serious, whether you've gotten some, um, some follow up reports from your from your doctor or some news about something you are really taking it serious to, to watch, you know, your health and protecting uh, yourself. Definitely a card for me to share with you and all of us in general, myself as well, that we need to um, protect our body and we need to make sure that, you know, it, it's, it's practicing good, all the good principles of good sleep, of a good diet, of, you know, um, being out in nature and as well as you know, eating right. And I uh, feel like I'm missing one more sleeping. Yes, sleeping, which <laughs> sometimes I am uh, very short of that. My brain is very active sometimes at night. So this is a beautiful message to have a conscious uh, and very deliberate approach to your health and, you know, um, move forward with whatever you need to do to progress and keep that that strength, you know, you've got that vehicle here, that strength, and you can do this. And you've got to be very careful to protect yourself. You know, we've got the night here as well. So very good reading in general, as far as, you know, if we watch ourselves, um, we can have a, a little better chance of buffering our, ourselves for that long-term haul that is called aging, okay? Okay, so let's move on to the next one. Let's move on to the next one. What is the next one? The next one is going to be career. The next one is going to be career. What does that mean? Career sometimes also falls in with that education, with um, uh, jobs, career, business, entrepreneurship, all of that, you know? And even um, anything that you're going to start venturing, ventures and things like that. So let's take a look at what we have here for career. Let's come in here. I'm getting the vibe to pick this particular card. 
Okay. So this is a very good card. Um, this sometimes uh, I see this card and some, and I see more of a victory. But when you look at it, it's it looks like people are actually fighting for something and and they're arguing and they're at odds and everything's getting mangled in there. So this one is showing up in reversed and reversed. And so it looks to as far as when it comes to career, um, some things and there's I'm getting a little bit more message than what's on this particular um, card. What I'm getting in is that the things that you saw as challenges are not going to be so bad. They're not going to be so bad. Uh, and, and you may, may think, well, you know, I'm not sure if I should take that job. You know, I'm not sure if I'm qualified for it. Well, guess what? There isn't any struggle right now. Uh, the demand for what I call human capital is so intense that this is a great time for you, if you were thinking about it, to jump in to those business opportunities or those careers, because the demand for that human capital is so big that you have a chance to rise up the ranks a lot faster, regardless of, you know, those, what you might think are your limitations. So definitely, uh, it's a go. A lot of good things are coming through. If there were issues in your current job, those things are now being moved away from the table, opening up now, making it a little bit more, more fluid, you know, more fluid to, to move and, and do things. So those obstacles are no longer there, no longer there. Okay, let's do our next one. What is the next next? area that we're going to look at. What is the next area that we're going to look at? Okay, and that is going to be travel. Is it now, is it showing up? Is there going to be any travel in your future for today, for today? Okay. okay. No travel, <laughs> no big travel plans right now. And you know what? It's good because there are things that you want to do, but I think you've, you've aligned your mindset that you want to get some things out of the way before you do uh, make any plans, but there isn't any, not even any short spurts of travel. It's in the, in the, in the horizon for today. It's really more focused about getting some things done that you've really needed to do and accomplishing some things and asserting yourself where you're at now and, and no impulsive traveling, no impulsing. Oh, let me go over here. Let me go over there. The best thing really to do is hunker down. Uh, this is not the time to, to be moving around too much. Okay. So there you have it. There you have it. So let's take a look at what is showing up for the collective, the collective uh, humans, us, the collective group that we are. Let's see what that message is, that overall arcing theme for today. Power, okay. So this is interesting because the power is upside down. So what happened? Um, when we take a look at, you know, are we overindulging? You know, are we not sharing? Are not we giving back to humanity? Um, uh, what's the other one that we saw here that had a little overall? Well, the travel. It's, it's, it's one thing, it, aside from this, what it's actually asking us to things. Are we giving our power away? Number one. Number two, what, uh, what are we doing to be in that sense of I am? And it is important that we, and as we come over here, you know, be in control of the now through our breath. You know, we need to be very in control of our now. And that goes back to that health card, you know. So 
Let's not give our powers to our fears. Let's not give over our powers to other people. Let's not give our powers to an uncertain future. Let's stay focused in the now. Can we do that? Can we breathe in and exhale and regain our power and regain our power by staying focused in the now? Okay, my friends. Well, there you have it for today. And thank you so much for joining me here at Fortune Forecast for your daily tarot reading. And if you've liked this or if anything has resonated with you, please take a minute to like, comment, if you'd like, share, and subscribe to our channel here. Thank you so very much. And I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. And with that, you got the power. See you back. Have a beautiful day.